Welcome in everybody, Mighty Donut 88 back with another video. This time we are going to be continuing The Walking Dead. Uh, last episode we, we had just hopped over to explore the other half of the junkyard. So let's go ahead and get right into it and see what happens. Hey look, there's one they never took to pieces. Hmm. Good catch. Maybe we can fix the AC. Shit. It's locked. All right. Here goes nothing. Please don't break. Fuck yeah. Siphon. Look at all that fuel. This is going to take a while. Oh, shit. I didn't want to go over there yet. Hmm. Looks like it came from in there. Well, I don't want to go back there yet. Stay close. But I want to... <laughs> I wanted to keep exploring the vehicle. Uh, I don't... Someone lives here. Might be able to get in through the hatch. Or lived. <laughs> Looks pretty run down. Locked. Okay. Hatch. Am I gonna get shot as soon as I get in here? I would announce our presence. Gabe, come check this out. Not the cleanest place. Well, no more at those at least. Just Don't be careful. Why don't we pick some of this stuff up? Wow, this place is decked out. Batteries. I know someone who will want those. Someone still lives here. Oh, it looks pretty comfortable. And pretty gross. Are you kidding me? Lucky for you, they put enough preservatives in this stuff to last for centuries. Oh, there's enough food in here to keep us going for a long time. Check it out. This is actual honest to God pudding. Seriously? And it's not just food. There's a mattress. There's blankets. Someone else's mattress. Someone else's blankets. We need to just yeah. take our gas and get on the road. Well, this place is kind of a dump. I mean, literally. And you forgot yep. to mention super freaking weird. It's a lot of food to leave in a place like this. Come on, one night. 
We bunk down, eat a real meal. It would be nice not to sleep in the van for a change. Please. The herd is coming, if it's not here already. We should go and get ahead of it, before it's too late. The fence is reinforced. We'll be fine. We found this. Why can't we just enjoy it? Javi, can we? We're gonna get what we came for and get out of here. This is someone Great. else's stuff. Another shitty cramped night in our shitty cramped van. Hooray. Come on, let's at least grab the food. Not too much. This is someone else's stuff. God, why would it give me the option to save him for later? I feel like that means we're gonna need him later. Oh, guess what? Uh, now, you can really drown us out. <laughs> Thanks for that. Backing me up and all. How does it feel to be the bad guy this time? It must be a new sensation for you. Oh no, oh boy, sleeping in the van again? <laughs> All I'll say is you definitely owe me one. <laughs> yeah, well, you owe me like a dozen, so <laughs> I'll just shave it off your tab. Hey, Kate, can you come help us with this? Hey, uh, wait, but you... This way you can make up for being the bad guy. Thanks. Grab some gas. I already did. We need to head out soon. I shouldn't have given the batteries yet. What the fuck do you think you're doing with our gas? Yep, called it. Go on, speak up! Whoa, whoa, look, the, the gas is all there. Just keep it. Yeah, I'm thinking it's a little too late for that. You ain't the loner type. I can tell. I know you got people. They're out scouting around. But they'll be back soon. They're not gonna be too happy if they see you pointing a piece at me. Yeah, probably not. Then again, maybe they're already here. Waiting to make an ambush. Fan out and look for the others. Lonnie, you're with me. I knew this wasn't going to end well. Hey! You assholes in there! I got your boy! If you don't want him getting shot, you best come out there careful with your hands up! Go on, you first. You get ambushed by your own people, that shit's going to make my day. Open it real slowly. Don't. Like you and your friends had a real feast, huh? You can't just take what you like. I don't roll over like that. Look, look, I I'll get you more food. Okay, I can replace everything, I That's swear. That's the goddamn least you can do. Look, yep. I, I, I get it, all right? You're starving. Who the fuck is it? At the end of your rope, thought you hit pay dirt. Honest mistake. But I got this sneaky fucking feeling. <laughs> You're full of shit. I ain't gonna let it be like the last time some assholes rolled on us. 
Keep an eye on this dickhead. I'm gonna grab some cuffs. You got it. Just chill, okay? No need to make this any harder. Look, your buddy's not thinking straight. So let's talk, okay? You and me, we, we can get this sorted out. No, it's his call. Look, man, this doesn't have to go. <laughs> the fuck was that noise? What you got hiding under there, boy? If you know something, you better spill it. Come on, man, what else? There are muertos down there. There were a bunch of them outside, too. The dead, huh? Well, then, we better take care of that, shouldn't we? Hey, my family, where are they? What did you do with my family? Fucking asshole. Just do us both a favor and pretend you're still asleep. I wouldn't start talking if I were you. You're lucky we do things a certain way. I'm already tempted to put a bullet in your brain for what you did to Lonnie back then. If we start talking, I'm gonna get angry. You have to go back. My family's back there. Hey. You gotta listen to me. There's a herd coming. A massive one. And yeah, we... and that's why we're driving away from it. Please, just... Stop, all right? You don't want me riled up, kid. Not another word, or God help me, I'll put you to sleep myself. We still got a haul ahead of us, and I'm not about to listen to you. What the hell? Stop! Stop! Oh, shit! No, no, no! Good job. Grab the gun. Hey! Hopefully that pays off for me in the end. <sighs> Fuck. <sighs> yeah. <sighs> All right. That's good. Just keep looking forward. Look, I'm no threat to you, okay? I surrender. Well, that's obvious. Seeing how you didn't shoot that guy. Oh my god. <gasps> okay, now don't do anything stupid. Because I'm not as nice as you. I won't hesitate. Clementine. You're a kid. Oh, wait, did you do that? With the tree? I was trying to stop the truck. Oh, shit. What do you need the truck for? To drive. Put your hands up and close your eyes. Look. I'm the victim here. We're all victims. Oh, so it's okay for you to rob me? This is payment for saving you. Hey, that's for my niece. She loves chocolate more than anything. I promised it to her. Please. Come on, Clementine. I taught you to be better than that. 
Keep your eyes closed and count to a hundred before you go. Wait, just... My family. I need to get back to them. We were attacked, and I don't... Look, I just need to know where I am. We were driving down the 522, and that's when we found the junkyard. They're still there. I need to get back to them. I know where that is. You said you were driving? In our van, yeah. I'll take you to the junkyard, if you let me have your van. I get you there in one piece, then I drive away. That van is our home. It's all we got. That sounds like a no. How about you just give me directions like a normal person? How about I shoot you and take the van anyway? This is a better deal for you. Let's go. This really necessary? I don't know you. I don't trust you. And I'm not taking any chances. So it's safer for both of us if you're tied up. Look, I get it. You're being cautious. Glad we understand each other. The name's Javier, by the way. People call me Javi. Clementine. Well, thanks for not killing me, Clementine. Don't thank me yet. what Jane taught you. You're good at that. Where's Jane and AJ and all Look, of them? You don't want to talk? Fine. But how about you give me that gun back so I can at least defend myself? For all I'd know, you'd turn around and use it on me. You give me a weapon, we can protect each other. I give you a weapon, I can't take my eyes off you. At least this way I know what I'm up against. It's kind of cool to see her from a third party. Where does the herd caught up with us? Muertos. What do you call them? Walkers. Well, what do you call the ones that run? They're all fucking walkers, okay? Look, I'm just. I'm not used to being around other people. Not for a while, anyway. Usually, it's just me on my own. No. Sounds kind of lonely, if you ask me. Well, I didn't ask you. And, anyway, I prefer it like that. No, what happened to AJ and Jane? So, who's at this junkyard? My brother's kids. And his wife. It's impressive, surviving this long. Not sure how you did it. Just keeping everyone together like that. I did whatever I had to do to protect them. Kept them out of trouble the best I could. Sucks. What? That sometimes it's not enough. Well, how about you? You must have been pretty young when this shit started. I was. But some people looked out for me too. What happened to them? They Same thing that happens to everyone. Shit. We can't stay here. There's a town up ahead. We can stay there until the herd passes. Otherwise, we're walker food. We can't make a detour. I need to get to my family. And I need that van. But right now, you have to trust me. Oh, you mean the way you trust me? Don't make me regret this. Come on! I'm glad Clementine became a badass. There! Get to the gate! I'll keep going! They'll open up! Shit! Hey! Open up! Open the 
gate till you clear them out. Can't risk it. Let's see this coming time. Go. Quick, open the gate just a few inches. Fuck! These bullets won't fire! <laughs> no. <laughs> she is such a bad- Get your ass inside! Come on, now! And damn it, Francine, one of these days, those doors are gonna close, and your ass will be on the other side. <laughs> yeah, and when that day comes, Trip, I promise, I'll eat you first. It's Clementine, right? You staying a while this time? No. Once the walkers pass, I'm taking this guy to a junkyard off the highway. My family might be trapped there, hiding from some very bad dudes. Well, shit. I'm truly sorry to hear that. This herd rolled in pretty quick. We're hoping it's gone just as fast. So, just keep your heads down and steer clear of trouble. You got me? There's too much going on outside the walls tonight. We'll be cool. Just need a place to ride out the herd, that's all. All right. I'm gonna hold you to that. And I wouldn't recommend changing your mind. If you wanna hang on to all your teeth, that is. All right, head on sure. in. I got shit to do. Well, welcome to Prescott. So Clementine knows this well. Is this anywhere near? It's a pretty cool place, actually. That village thing? Built that, from an old that, airstrip, I guess. Uh, place where the shoe was staying last? It the people, like on it. the other hand, they're not my favorite. Usually I'm in and out as quick as I can manage. Not exactly an option this time, though. Hey, what's the problem? You have some sort of history here that I should know about? Not really. I just... I know what people are capable of. Hey, Javi. What's... what's up? My family... They're still out there. In the middle of all that. If you guys made it this long, I I'm sure you know... They'll know what to do. Hopefully. Let's go. This way. I gotta see a guy about some bullets. <laughs> Jeez. I haven't been in a place like this since... Well, you know. It's just like the old days. Listen, I gotta take care of something. Hang tight. Well, wait, wait. What should I do? I don't know. Why don't you make some friends? <laughs> Clementine just as charming as ever. I wonder how old she is at this point. I wonder where they found this old thing. I haven't seen one of these in years. Excuse me. Oh, you again. You got some moves, I'll give you that. What? Hold on a minute. Don't I note you from somewhere? I don't know. Maybe. Garcia. Javier Garcia. For what it's worth, I think you got screwed on the gambling thing. A lifetime ban. Shit. Should've had a 20-year career. The way I see it, nothing wrong with betting on yourself to win. Honestly, I don't even think about it anymore. Past is the past. Hm. Fair enough. Anyway, I'm Conrad. This here's Francine. He runs the place? I just take his money. <laughs> yeah, well, maybe I'm just letting you win. Oh, actually, if you're the gambling type... Game's poker. Five card stud. I'll raise you. What do you think? Should I call or should I fold? Hmm. Don't get too intimidated. Ooh. I lose more often than I care to admit. No, all it takes is one good That's hand. decent. Two pair. He's bluffing. He's got bullshit written all over him. <laughs> is that a fact? All right. I think I'll listen to the man. Call. Moment of truth. Flip him. Oh, my. Ain't that a pretty sight? 
<laughs> oh, hell yeah. Nice. Oh, calm down, both of you. Thanks for the advice, hon. How's about a drink? On my tab. Bottoms up. Oh, man, this smells like turpentine. <laughs> That's the weak stuff. Don't turn away from me. I'm talking to you. Oh, shit. Hey, what's the point in talking when I already told you a deal is a deal? And it's done. What's going on? This guy ripped me off. I traded him a crate of perfectly good batteries, and he gave me a box of bullets that won't fire. He could have gotten both of us killed. Oh, yeah? And who the fuck are you, a bodyguard or something? Because I don't scare easy, all right? She doesn't need a bodyguard. She can take care of herself. Believe me. Uh, well, you can't even prove those are the bullets I traded you. Oh, hey, Clem, come on. He knows the bullets don't work. Listen to him. He's not even nervous. I could have died because of his... fucking believable. Look out! What a fucking answer. What happened to not causing issues? Hey, listen. Let's all cool down, huh? You were acting crazy, I was too. We just got a little out of hand. Mm -hmm. That's all. Just give me what I'm owed. Jesus. You gotta get her under control, man. No, I'm good. This ain't no way to do business. Boy, you have it wrong, buddy. I don't control her, which looks like bad news for you. We had a deal. All right, hey, okay, all right, so, hey, we'll, we'll trade back. I'll find some batteries. I don't need batteries. What I need are bullets that won't get me killed. Oh. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, my Drop God. Drop the gun. Clint. Right now. Say he attacked you and that he was going for his gun. I fucking warned you. Eli attacked him. I only shot because... Shut it. You done enough talking. Drop it. There's a herd out there and you're firing off a fucking... What the fuck happened here? He attacked Javi, okay? It was self-defense. Enough from you. Did she really have to shoot? Yes. Look at my eye, man. Of course she's telling the truth. The guy ripped her off, reached for his gun, and would have shot me if she hadn't stopped him. See? You happy now? <sighs> God damn it. I'm putting you two under lock and key until I figure out what to do Whoa. with you. Oh, hey, what? Are you for real? As real as it gets. Now move it. You got some nerve coming in here fucking up my bar. I'd have punched your fucking lights out. Both of you. But Eli was a grade A certified dipshit. I'll even have someone come take a look at that cut. Hey. Thanks for having my back at the hangar. That was, um... That was cool of you. I wasn't sure there for a minute. Of course. Anytime. Well, I mean, you and I are a team now. Thanks. I mean it. Just don't think this makes us friends or anything. Hello? I'm Eleanor. I'm what passes for a doctor around here. The trip sort of overdoes it sometimes. I hate that I'm treating you in a cage, like you're some feral animal. And I'm starting to think this trip guy, kind of a prick. He means well. He's just got a lot on his shoulders. Now, let's see about that wound. Yeah, he got you good. Try to hold still. <clears throat> Why is it always the pretty ones who end up causing the most trouble? As if good looks equal bad behavior or something. I've never understood it. Yeah? Well, it takes one to know one. One what? One pretty troublemaker. <laughs> I'll give you that one. People are saying she killed a man in cold blood. If you don't mind me asking. What did happen exactly? That they were arguing and that she went crazy over nothing? 
Look, things got out of hand. Clementine was only trying to make a point, but then... You make it sound so casual. Best thing is probably for you two to leave town. And get back to your group. We were attacked earlier this evening. There were four of us. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. If there's... If there's anything I can do to help... Let us out. Well, not that I have much to offer you, but... I know a thing or two about losing family. If you really want to help me, let us out of this cage. Eleanor? You done yet? Just about. All right. Here's what we're gonna do. I'm driving you that junkyard myself. Get you out of my hair, and no one can say I didn't do right by no one. In the meantime, you two can sleep right here and think about what shitheads you were earlier. On my terms and on my timeline. You got me? All right. Fair enough. Fair enough? Go kiss a skunk's ass. I should be earning a goddamn Boy Scout badge for this. Trip, it doesn't seem right to wait. Javi's people, they could need a medic. No, -uh, no way. Not putting you in that kind of danger again. That's not your call. Look, maybe there's another way. We've got a rear gate down at the other end of the airfield. We don't use it much, but, well, we could leave tonight. Slip past the herd, get a jump start on reaching that junkyard. It's too risky, and if Muertos were to somehow surround us, we... Don't worry. It'll be fine. Anyway, think about it. I've got to check on some patients, but I'll be back in an hour. You know, I never would have guessed she had it in her. Yeah, she's... She's something. The thing is, is, and maybe this sounds weird, but I still trust Trip more than I trust her. Oh, God. We need to get back to the family. We're leaving tonight with Eleanor. If it gets us there even a minute sooner, it's worth it. All right. I'm in. You know, when I met you, I thought you'd just be another asshole like everyone else. And to think that when we first met, you nearly blew my head off. <laughs> yeah. Guess I made the right call. Sounds like Eleanor will be a little while. Maybe we should get a few winks. Good idea. I'm exhausted. I'll get the lamp. y'all that's where we're gonna stop it for today i'm so glad clementine's back that's awesome but yeah i hope you guys are enjoying we're gonna keep playing through this we've got a lot to go still so if you enjoyed please leave a like and a comment and consider subscribing to get the rest of this playthrough and i will catch you guys tomorrow for more walking dead